All right, this is part three. I have 35 minutes of my phone. Obviously. And after this video, I will end my video. I will upload it. Obviously, watch it could maybe watch the first part of my video. And I'll take my shower, go to the store, cast my check, go get my beer, my smokes. And uh, I will not get Pizza Hut today because my set my set parents made hamburgers upstairs. And so I don't want to waste money, right? I'll just get eat the hamburgers upstairs. It saves me money anyways. And then tomorrow I might walk, get my beer from Smokes and I might get my Pizza Hut and I'll watch the Batman. Uh, the Batman. Watch the Batman. Obviously. Yeah. Yeah, Peter, I want to release it. I want to sell I want to sell it as a series on 4K Blu-ray. He's like, oh, 4K Blu-ray, Ivan. I'm like, yeah, 4K Blu-ray. 4K Blu-ray is top-notch, Ivan. You know, I said, yeah, yeah, Ivan, that's smart. If, 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 because your company is, is direct is, is direct to home video, obviously, I think it's best you release it on 4K Blu-ray. That way you get a good experience. Yeah, you want the viewers to get a good experience, release it on 4K Blu-ray. You have your theaters, you pimp out your house, theaters, you, you have your theater system, you have, your 4K, you have the 4K Blu-ray experience. I said, yeah, yeah, Peter, I want to sell it as a box set. I even want to release it one year at a time. I'm like, no, Peter, I don't want to keep the fans waiting. Yeah, because Peter Jackson wants to make more money. Because Peter Jackson knows if I give him, if he gets 0.6% like, of all, of what, of all three movies, he's going to make like $900 million in royalties. He wants to make more money. I was like, Peter, no. I don't want to keep the fans waiting. I'm going to release it in a box set. All three volumes will be stored in the box set. The way you don't keep the fans waiting. Because for my movie, you don't want to keep the fans waiting, man. You don't want to have the fans wait one year for the next movie. No, just just release it. Release all three volumes at the same time on a, on a, in a box set. It's easier that way. For my movie. You see what I'm saying? And then, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? And people ask, okay, Ivan, what are you thinking of for Eric? You know what I'm saying? Ivan, I'm thinking you should have Eric be a full on CGI wolf. I'm like, no, Peter, I don't want Eric to have to be a full-on CGI wolf. I'm not a fan of that look. The Goblin King and the Orcs in The Hobbit looked a bit cheesy. I'm not a fan of full CGI for, 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 for what? Full CGI for, 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 for Xanus. The Gremlin Tor's like, I want to go to Werewolf. You know what I'm saying? What if you have Eric to look like a werewolf? I'm like, no, Gremlin Tor, I don't want Eric to look like a werewolf. The movie won't be as good. You know what I'm saying? And Peter Jackson and Toro were like, hey, Ivan, if you don't want Eric to have to be a full-on CGI, Ivan... Peter's like, Ivan, CGI technology is where it's at, man. That's what that's what everyone uses. Everyone uses CGI for villains, Ivan. For Stefan Wolf, for Thanos, the Goblin King, Azog, and the Hobbit, they all they were all full on CGI characters, Ivan. You know what I'm saying? Like, Ivan, like, what do you if if, if, if Ivan, if you want Eric to look natural and you want him to wear a mask and wear a costume, what are you thinking of, Ivan? Like, what are you thinking of, Ivan? He might he might be curious. Okay, okay, Peter, I'm thinking this. I sh I, I I give him the picture that I printed. I show him the animal picture. He's like, oh, I, that's cool. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know, so this is pretty cool. I, I can picture, yeah, Eric, the, the characters, the voice actors, they wear a mask and a costume like this. Yeah. I mean, you're looking at demons. You want them three times scarier than these beings here? Yes. I want them three times scarier than these beings here. So the wolves will, wear, will look like Pennywise a clown, except they're going to wear a costume and mask similar to, 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 to the costume that that actor wore for the devil being an animal. And the, the, the bats are going to wear a costume... Similar to that costume that uh, that of that devil being an animal, and they're gonna they're, they're gonna look like the hybrid of the boss from Lord of the Rings, and the devil being an animal. So I want Eric. I'm thinking of something like this for the costumes, for the costumes and the mask. Something like this, like this picture here. This devil being an animal. You know how it looks very natural, but it looks very scary. Remember how you saw Annabelle? The demon looked natural, but he was very scary. Yes, I want the demons looking more natural, but they look they're scary. They're demons. Three times scarier than that devil being animal and Pennywise a clown. Peter's like, holy shit, I'm in your prep. I can picture your feces looking like this, I'm saying. Yeah, he's like, holy shit, I'm in your prep. Like, before you even hired us, you prepped everything with your wife? Yes, like, before I, before I hired Peter Jackson, or my Gibson, I prepped everything with my wife, man. Because I'm prepped, obviously. I took my notes, we took our notes, or I don't know, our six to ten pages worth of notes. You know what I'm saying? We took our six to ten pages worth of notes. We took our six to ten pages worth of notes. You know what I'm saying? We what? We, we, we what? I read the Sideful book a couple times, and I studied Peter Jackson's Fellowship of the Ring script. And so I'm prepped. 
for writing my script as well as do, us doing the, the, the during the board meetings. I'm prepped. And Peter Jackson's like, holy shit, John Fallon and Dave Filoni and Peter Jackson, like, holy shit, Ivan's prepped. Ivan has no experience in the fucking way making a movie and he's fucking prepped. You know what I'm saying? He took his nose, he, he already knows how he wants Aerith to look like. Yeah, I took my, I, 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 I'm prepped, man. I'm prepped for my movie. You see what I'm saying? Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Okay, Peter. Okay, Peter, I, I'm, I'm going to find the company. The company that designed the mask. The company that designed the mask and costumes for that devil being an animal. I'm going to, I'm going to, I'm going to, I'm going to, I'm going to what? I'm going to find that company that, that designed those costumes and masks. To, 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 for, 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 for the costumes and masks for my Zayas movie. I'm going to rent the best machines in the world. In, 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 for creating all those demonic masks and costumes. Because you not only have to create the mask, you have to create the costumes too for the... For, 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 for the main characters. I can have them create the costumes for the main characters. Where the extras I can just have. The extras I can just have the, the, the extras just wear their mask. And you can have them wear like this costume. And you just apply the CGI, the CGI effects towards their costumes. Because the extras are, are background actors obviously. Whereas all the main characters you need to have to create the costumes and the mask. Something similar like that animal, that devil being an animal. That I showed you a couple days ago. And, 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 you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Holy shit, Ivan, you're prepped. Yes. I know what I'm doing, man. I am prepped. I know what I'm doing. I know what I'm doing, obviously. I know. I know what I am doing. I know. I know what I'm doing. I know what I'm doing. Yeah. I'm going to ask Peter. Peter, Peter, for the wall of Zaynus, for the wall of Zaynus, do you want to, you want to have Weta Workshop create a small miniature set? In studio, and they have and they have the camera film the the, the, the film the, the miniature set, and you apply the special effects in the movie, or do you want to actually build like a 30, 30, a thirty feet wall like you did for Helm's Eve? No, no, Ivan, Ivan, we can build the wall. The only reason why I did that for Lord of the Rings is because we we, we, we couldn't we just couldn't we couldn't afford it, Ivan. We I had a small shitty night. You might just Hollywood. I had Hollywood gave me a shitty nine on our budget. We couldn't afford to 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 build the Black Gate of Moria on location. I'm saying we have we have to build. A small miniature set and have the camera film it and you apply the CGI effects towards the movie obviously because the black gate that you saw in two towers that was they they, they, they didn't build a, a set on location no they built like a small miniature set and they had the people film the miniature set obviously and they apply the special effects towards the miniature set obviously to make it look real on on on, on, on to make it look real for the movie it looked pretty good obviously it looked amazing but you're asking me Ivan no no Ivan Ivan we can afford it thirty million dollars we can easily afford to build the wall. Build the wall. You know I'm saying, I don't want them to, um, to save money. Build a small like 30, 30 feet wall, and you just apply the special effects towards the wall. Obviously, hey, I'm thinking, Peter, is you think you think I should, Peter? You think yeah, yeah, I, we can build all all, all 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 the exterior sets on location, like like, like your different Helm's Deep, Rohan, and 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 the Shire. So for 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 Cyrus, you can build something like the Shire. For Safish, you can build something like um, Minas Tirith. Minas Tirith was built on location too. They built a small set. Yeah, you can build a set for Minas Tirith. Obviously, Minas Tirith, obviously. Build, sorry, build a set for Safius. Similar to Gondor, you build Zanus. I can have I can have Zanus be 1.5 acres. Safius, 0.8, 1 acre. 0 0.8 acres. Cyrus, 0 0.6 acres. It's huge. It's half a football stadium. You know what I'm saying? You can have what? Barak, 1.5 acres. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, and the forest of Galathia, 0 0.8. The, 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 the mountain, one acre mountain. Mountain of Gilead, a 0 0.70 acre mountain for the northern mountain of Gilead. A one acre city for the ancient Gilead city. You know what I'm saying? You, they had a crewman build all these pillars, something like top notch. That's why your world will look amazing. Yeah, man. 
The world will look the look the world will look amazing, but it'll look very natural. Because I, I poured a lot of money towards practical effects, towards set building. If you want your world to look amazing but look more natural, you gotta put a lot of money towards your your, your practical effects. Your set building. That way you and you and you add in the special effects and the CGI and your world looks amazing. It doesn't have that computer look like the ring. Peter, I don't want that computer to look like like Rings of Power and fucking uh and, 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 and the Hobbit. No man, I want the, the natural look like Lord of the Rings. Like you got for Fellowship of the Ring. And and, and, and and Robin Hood and all that stuff. You see what I'm saying? The world will look amazing, but Ivan, yeah, Ivan, that's smart. Your world will look amazing, better than even my Lord of the Rings movie and Avatar and the Hobbit, but it'll look very natural. Yes, the world looks amazing, but it looks natural. I know what I'm doing. Now, well, you get a better movie. If you have that, if you have that computery Rings of Power look, and the Hobbit, the movie will not be as good. It'll be, a, it'll still be a masterpiece. But it won't be as good, man. You'll have Airtel, Airtel will be cheesy, a little cheesy, he's full on CGI. It'll be cheesy. No, have Air, have the voice actor for Airtel wear a mask. But I don't, I'm going to tell you, Peter, I don't want them wearing masks like they did for Lord of the, like, 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 like the Orcs from the Rings. No, otherwise the movie won't be as good. I don't want Eric to have him, to have, I, I don't want prosthetic, prosthetic masks like the or what the Orcs wore in Lord of the Rings. No, I want a more professional mask, like that devil being an Annabelle. Something like that, for Ephesus and Eric to have a fool on them. That way it looks scarier, obviously. But if you have them like the Orcs, they won't be as scary. You see what I'm saying? I know what I'm doing. Obviously, I saw the uh, what? I saw the third Rings of Power trailer. The, movie, the show looks okay. You know what I'm saying? It looks okay, but I, I'm, I'm gonna talk about Rings of Power. Even though Rings of Power looks okay, something tells me it will not be the next Game of Thrones. But it, I, so, it, but but it won't flop though. I think Game of Thrones. I think I think Rings of Power will be an okay show. I saw the trailer earlier this morning. The 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 the, 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 the movie looked okay. The trailer. The, the show looks okay. But what worries me about that show is they don't have source material. They only have the appendices because 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 um, um Amazon does not have the rights to the Semilarian, Children of Hurin, or or any of those books, History of Middle Earth. They don't have the rights to those books. Hence why what. It uh it, it gets, it's a little it's a little bit of a red flag that that, that, that they what well, they they don't have much source material. But who knows? The show might be a hit. The Rings of Power show might be a hit. You never know. It might be a hit. It might be the next Game of Thrones. You never know, right? We'll see what happens, obviously. I recommend all you guys check it out. On Amazon Prime on September 2nd, The Rings of Power is coming out. On September 2nd on Amazon Prime, The Lord of the Rings television show. All right, when you watch it, of course I'm going to watch I'm a Lord of the Rings fan. Anything to do with Star Wars, Lord of the Rings, I watch, obviously. I'm going to watch The Rings of Power, obviously. I'm also going to watch... Uh, watch... Uh, I also watch Star Wars. I watch all the Star Wars shows, obviously. Except for, like, Bad Batch and Vision. I don't, I, I'm not a fan of those shows. But all the, the live-action shows I watch on, on Disney+. Plus, Obviously, you see what I'm saying? What's up, Peter? You know, I don't want that Rings of Power look. That computer look. No, man. I'm not a fan of that. I don't want that look that you got for The Hobbit. You know what I'm saying? Okay, Peter. I want to... Okay, okay, Peter. I want to film my movie in IMAX. Hey Peter, is there I is there film and digital? I yes, Ivan. There's film and digital IMAX camera. I checked on who was. I showed you the picture. That picture I showed you. That's the film IMAX camera. Yeah, Ivan. Hollywood has film and and digital IMAX cameras. Okay, Peter. I want to film the movie in film IMAX camera. That way you get the natural look like you did for Lord of the Rings. I don't want to film it in digital cameras like you did for for for, for the Hobbit. Otherwise, you film it in digital. You're gonna get the you're you're gonna get that computer look. Digital camera makes your world look more amazing, but you get you, you don't get the natural look. Your world looks more computery. You see what I'm saying? That's why I'm like, look, look, Peter, I want to film it in IMAX film, not IMAX digital. Okay, okay, I okay, okay. You know what I'm saying? And the more me and make the calls to Peter Jackson, obviously, all the companies in Hollywood are all in the system. Peter Jackson's like, holy, yeah, I, I know all the companies. You know what I'm saying? And Peter Jackson's like, holy shit, I mean, like, all the companies in Hollywood are all, all in your system. Yeah, all the companies for cameras, for special effects, for trailers. For set building, all the companies I'm saying it's the corner for the cameras, the drones, the camera stands, you know what I'm saying, the CGI technology, special effects, all in the system, obviously, the clothing, the costumes, the weapons, all the best companies for costumes, weapons, armor, the sewing equipment, the machine for the masks are all in the system, yeah. And that that way it's easier for me and my seventeen and Peter Jackson to make the calls, obviously. So the, the company the company that the company that designed the company that designed the what the math, the armor, the costumes and masks, obviously for 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 Annabelle, 
you know, for that, for that, for that dopamine animal, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna find that company, and I'm gonna call that company um, that designed the, uh, uh, um, that designed. What I might do is I might give, I might give the company that made, I might call Hollywood, I might call the Hollywood company, I might call the Hollywood company that 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 made Animal. I'm like, hey, for your movie, hey, I, I, for your movie Animal, for your movie Animal that you did. What 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 com what company what machine did you use to create those masks and armor? Yeah, we, we use this. We we use this company. We use this machine. And um, me and Peter Jackson, we call that company. And that comp the company that created those that did that devil mask and the costumes that 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 kind of costume and mask. Obviously, I'm gonna call that company to create all the demon masks for Eratat and for Fool and all of them. And they're gonna wear like this professional demonic mask, three times scarier than that devil being an animal and Pennywise the clown man. You're looking at devils. You're looking at demons, man. You're looking at demons. Fucking demons, yeah, man. You're looking at demons, guys. You're looking at demons. Demons, guys. Demons. You're looking at demons. You're looking at demons, guys. Demons. Literal demons. Really, I mean, yeah, you're looking at demons, guys. Something so scary, guys, you guys. There was once I do the concert arts with uh, with Peter Jackson in that nice room, you know what I'm saying? My nice building, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Once I do concert arts with Peter Jackson, with Molo Toro, and VJ. And John Falvin and Filoni and 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 me and we all we all decided what we want Airtight to look like. Obviously, the crazy psychotic mass of King in the South. Obviously, once 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 we uh, we bring the picture to life because because John what well, I'll have John Howe and all of them draw sketches of, of the animals and warbling, and then once they draw the sketches, I'm gonna have I'm gonna, I might have my graph designers put them to work. Have your graph designers design the pictures, design the pictures on Photoshop, and they bring the characters to life. You can have your graph designers design those pictures, obviously, for you if you want. Or you can have John Howe and all of them color it themselves if you want. Or you, because I'll have John Howe and them, John Howe and all of them draw sketches of the animals and the and the walls, obviously. And then Peter Jackson's like, "Holy shit!" I mean, once once he, once we see the picture, all of the like brought to life with the colors and all stuff. Uh, you know, see me, VJ, Peter Jackson, Toro, Mel Gibson, you know what I'm saying, or or what. Or John John Farron, I was like, holy shit, Ivan, you're looking at the devil, Ivan, this is scary, Ivan. Ivan, you're looking at the walking devil himself. Ivan, Ivan, I can only imagine, how, Ivan, you're, you're, you're going to design masks that look exactly like, you're going you're, 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 you're to have the people design the masks based off these console arts. You're looking at demons, three times scarier than that devil being an animal, and you're going to apply four hundred million dollars to wear that demonic mask, Ivan. Ivan, you're looking at the devil himself, the walking, you're looking at the most horrific villain in movie history. Peter Jackson, holy shit, Ivan, your movie will have so much buzz. Remember what Tori really, Ivan, your movie will have so much buzz. This movie's gonna have a lot of buzz, Ivan. You're gonna see Grandma Toro, Peter Jackson, holy shit, Ivan, this movie's gonna have a lot of buzz. You know what I'm saying? This movie's gonna have so much buzz. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, you're gonna see Grandma Toro and Hugh Jackson. Ivan, we just shook the world. This movie's gonna have crazy buzz, yeah. You, the prince, fighting this devil being, and, and all your stars are experiences. I mean, like all these, you see, you see the concept art of Eratat, Ephesus, for fool, morale, Darius, Bass, you know what I'm saying? Bull the Pit Watcher. Okay, John Han Ali, I want Bull the Pit Watcher to have a deformed face. Remember that orc? Remember that orc in, uh, in Return of the King? The, the, the boss orc, obviously, the, time, the leader of the army? The time of the orc has come. I forget his name. Um, who had that like the form this figure for yeah? Think of something like that for Bo. He has this, this disfigured face, but he, I don't want them looking like I don't want them creating masks like the orcs in Lord of the Rings. No, otherwise the movie won't be as good. No, I want them having I want the devil beings to have masks like that devil being an animal, something like a more professional mask like that. Except they're three times scarier. They're demons. They're demons and devils. You see what I'm saying? They're demons and devils. They're demons and devils, you see what I'm saying? <laughs> They're 
they're demons and devils. That's why me and VJ and Peter Jackson are gonna have a blast, man. Peter Jackson's gonna even though P, even though me and v, me and Peter are gonna be doing dirty work, writing the script is dirty work. It's nothing compared to how much the seventeen would do. Me and VJ and Peter will be chilling, man. As writing the script will be fun, because Zayn's is an amazing story. To, 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 to it's, Zayn's is an amazing story. It's 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 an amazing story to adapt, obviously. And the doc teams filming us. We're having a blast, man. Writing the script every day. Hey Peter, all you have to do is work on a script two and a half hours a day, and we're done. And you, when you go home, you take your, like, you dedicate a good hour of your time, you take your notes, and you're done. You get, you get the rest of the day off. Slack work, man. Obviously. Yeah, man. Slack work. Slack fucking work, man. Slack work. Slack work. Obviously. It'll be dirty work, but compared to the seven team, it's slack work. Me and VJ are chilling. Me and VJ, Peter Jackson, or Mel Gibson are chilling. I'm saying, I'm saying, I'm seven team will be doing all the grueling dirty work, whereas me and, v, me and VJ and Peter will be doing. VJ, me and Peter will be doing dirty work because writing the script is dirty work, obviously, but it's not as, as bad as the, the work, the kind of work the seven team. The seven team are doing dirty work, man. Making all those business calls, a lot of work, man. Uh, that's why what. Yeah, because I paid Peter ten million dollars for pre-production, he'll work hard. Obviously, he got he got a nice like six million dollar check in his bank, man. Six point eight million check in his bank. That's how much he made for fucking the whole, the whole, the whole, the whole, the whole for side for the whole move for the whole for a whole like five years. Of Lord of the Rings. I heard Peter Jackson made ten million for Lord of the Rings around there. He made a, he he made ten million bucks for the movie, and he worked hard. And I'm I'm paying him ten million for pre-production alone. He'll work hard. <laughs> That's a lot of money. He got like six point eight million dollars in his bank. He'll work hard. He'll work really hard. So then, because he got his millions in his bank, so I'm saying he'll work really hard, Peter Jackson. You see what I'm saying? He'll work hard. He will work hard. He won't slack off. So I'm saying. That's why I'm looking at the best story I've told the most vision for Zanis, man. Trust me, once Peter Jackson reads my book, you know, I don't know, Peter Jackson, he buys the print or he buys the ebook. He buys the print. He pays his 100 bucks, obviously, right? He buys the print, you know what I'm saying? The print arrives in the book. High chance most people are going to buy the ebook because no one wants to wait, man. There's some, there's some fans, some of you Lord of the Rings nerds, what you guys might do is you guys might buy the, pay your 22 bucks. You buy the ebook, obviously. You buy the ebook, obviously, and then later on you buy the print for a collection. Because a lot of fans around the world don't don't want to wait like a week, two weeks for their book they, for my book. They want to read my book right away. Hence why a lot of people are gonna want to buy the uh, what are 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 are, 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 are gonna want to buy the uh, are gonna buy the ebook because they don't want to wait. And ebook is cheaper. Ebook is only I'm only gonna price my ebook for twenty two bucks. It's cheap. Twenty two bucks with taxes is like you're gonna you're only gonna pay like twenty six dollars in taxes. With tax, with tax, you pay your 26, 27 bucks, cheap, obviously, whereas the book is like 100 bucks, you're going to pay like your one, like, $19, 100 bucks is pretty pricey for an average person, it's affordable, obviously, but it's pricey, obviously, but a lot of book nerds, a lot of you book nerds on Fantasy Reddit and, and, and Lord of the Rings Reddit are going to buy the print, most likely, because book, book nerds like having a collection, uh, like, like, yeah, I want to have, I want to have Ivan's Last of Us as, as a collection uh, in, in my shelf, obviously, where some people will just buy the ebook and read on their laptop. You see what I'm saying? They might buy the ebook and read on their laptop, obviously. They might buy the ebook and read on their laptop, obviously. 
obviously. I don't know. Peter Jackson, he buys the print or he buys the ebook. I know he buys the, uh, he might buy the ebook. He doesn't want to wait. He buys the ebook. He reads my book on his laptop, obviously. You know, so let's see how good Ivan's book really is. You know I'm saying, all you Lord of the Rings nerds, I want to keep talking about this. I want to talk about this. all you Lord of the Rings nerds. I don't know. You buy the ebook. You know, what I'm saying you go in your backyard, you sit on your porch, you get your beer, you have a, you have your beer, and you you just read my book on your on your iPad, and you and, and you, leave, you read my book on your iPad, and and and, and, and your what, and your, and your laptop, obviously. Let's see how good Ivan's book is. Ivan's been bragging. You know, I'm saying he says his movie will be better than Peter Jackson because he has some serious guts. You know what I'm saying, he says what his his book is better than all these big authors' books. All it's like George R. R. Martin's book, Harry, Harry, J.K. Rowling's book, Stephen Erickson's book, J.R. Tolkien's book, Brian Sanderson's book, Robert Jordan's book. Let's see how good this book really is. You read the prologue. Oh, well, the prologue's pretty good. You know, what I'm saying this is so cool. The North and the South. This is so cool. You get the birth of Tacius, the birth of a fool. You know, that's pretty cool. The prologue, obviously, and then you read, you read what? You read what? You read uh, of chapter one, young Tactius. You know, what I'm saying, young Tactius. Holy shit, this is interesting. You know, it's in the young Tactius. This is a sick book, man. This is sick. You know, what I'm saying, and Peter Jackson reads it. He's like, holy shit, this book is sick. This is an interesting book. I'm having, I'm enjoying Army's book a lot more than J.R.R. Tolkien's book. Yes, as J.R.R. Tolkien's book. No offense, even though it's a masterpiece, it's, it's a drag to read. I'm just speaking the truth here, man. Even though Jared Tolkien's book is a masterpiece, it's, 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 it's a bit of a drag to read sometimes. And all you Lord of the Rings, Lord of the Rings, Reddit, who love Lord of the Rings, who love the movies and books, you know what I'm talking about. Yeah, I know what you're talking about. Yes, Lord of the Rings, Jared Tolkien was criticized for his dry writing and his over-descriptive uh, over sentences, obviously. His over-descriptive pages. As Jared Tolkien, he 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 over describes everything. You see, what I'm saying it's 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 it's, it's hence it can get it can get repetitive and get annoying when you when you when you what when you read his book. Obviously, I read Fellowship of the Ring like two and a half times. I read Two Towers and I read Return of the King. I'm telling you right now, even though it's a good book, it's a good series. It's not as good as my book. My book is more interesting, man. It's more interesting. You're you're gonna be a lot more hooked when you read it. Obviously. And then by I know Peter Jackson reads chapter two. Peter Jackson reads chapter two, obviously. All you Lord of the Rings nerds, you read chapter two. And then once you read chapter two, and the story picks up, it gets more interesting, tacky as these walls, obviously. You know what I'm saying? Peter Jackson will read it. It's like, holy shit, this book is sick. Eric had the devil walking in the cell, tacky as the prince of the north. This is a sick book. You know what I'm saying? This is kind of like Lion King. You know what I'm saying? You have the north, you have the south, the south is cursed. You know what I'm saying? This is a sick book, you know what I'm saying? And guaranteed all you Lord of the Rings nerds are going to order your takeout. Oh my god, this book is sick. I am ordering takeout, man. You guys drive to the store, you get your you get your Subway, you get your Wendy's, you get your McDonald's, you get your Burger King, you get your pizza. You know what I'm saying? You get your beer. You get your wine. You sit in your porch, you read my book, and you binge all of Volume 1 in that one day. <laughs> There's some people who might even binge Volume 1 and even Volume 2 in one day. They might, they might read the whole thing. They might binge the whole thing, the whole thing in the... If you if you start reading my book in the morning, you can binge all volume two in that one day. And in two days, three days, you'll you'll finish reading the book. You know what I'm saying? The book will be so interesting, you're, you're, you're not gonna want the story to end. Oh man, I oh man, like you know what I'm saying? You know, even though my book is long, it's like five, it'll be like a six hundred page book. By the time you binge volume one, like holy shit, this went by fast. Yeah, the reason why it went by fast is because my book is interesting. I kept you hooked for, for all of volume one. Uh, I kept you hooked for all of volume one. I, and I kept you hooked for all of volume one. And before you know it, like 200 plus pages go by and you're done volume one. And volume two is even more interesting when Tachyus meets Lithia and all them. Tachyus Papari and the meet Lithia and all them. And Sapphius. You know what I'm saying? You have Tacitonius, they fight for fool and his 25 wolves with their 50 men. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, holy shit, this book is sick. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, this is a sick book. Yeah. And as, as from once Peter Jackson reads, I don't know. Once Peter Jackson uh, finishes my book, obviously, it's finally gonna dawn on him. He's it's, he's that, that thought will cross his mind. Yeah, yeah, I see Ivan's point now. You know what I'm saying? I, I, yeah, 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 yeah. Even though Ivan was being an asshole, he was cocky. You know what I'm saying? Saying he thinks his movie would be better than my my movie. He thinks his movie, his book, is better than Jared Tolkien's book. Obviously, fuck, Ivan was right. I I I finally see Ivan's point now. You know, I like no author has ever kept me hooked the way Ivan has. 
all these Lord of the Rings nerds are like, yeah, yeah, no author has ever kept me hooked the way Ivan has. Ivan has a unique, a, a unique style of writing. Like, like, he took me for a ride when I read his book. His book was sick. I was hooked the whole way through. He took me for a ride. Fucking interesting story, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Little raw in some sections, obviously, but fuck is a masterpiece. Yeah, shut up, kind of here.